God, REI Caregiver Moment. My name is Kayan Church, a.k.a. the Big Hearted Caregiver. What I do is I help family members with distressed loved ones become paid caregivers through our personal assistance service agency. Now listen, today's episode is all about phase three of the reopening of Delaware, you know, during this uh, COVID times. Now listen, but first... I'm going to tell you how to uh, best be able to act with your parents, you know, during this phase three of the reopening. But before we get into that, uh, if you or anybody you know would personally like to work with me, write in the comments, let's get started, you know, and I'll personally help you figure out what we need to do for you in your situation and get back to you as soon as possible. Now, look, <clears throat> we talking about phase three of this reopening of Delaware today. And what does that mean for our parents, our loved ones, our seniors you know, all the people that may be in uh, maybe a little bit of distress that need our help every day. Now, they kind of worried. The governor of Delaware is kind of worried about the reopening of phase three. He personally felt that things were moving a little too fast and he put the brakes on it, which I think personally is an excellent thing. You know, hats off to the uh, to the government in position right now in the state of Delaware because they really seem to be looking out for the seniors, you know, and they look out for the other people who not really thinking like they need to be thinking because, yo, this COVID thing is serious and it's definitely not open. It's not over. I'm sorry. So, uh... He said the decision was to get a better handle on what's going on in Delaware and around the country. Now check out what he said. Too many Delawareans and visitors are not following basic public health precautions. We have heard and seen concerns, especially in our beach communities, in our restaurants, in our gyms, and at our sporting events. Now listen, this COVID thing is serious and now is definitely not the time to let up. Listen, you don't want to let your guard down at all. You're required to wear masks in public settings. Listen, that mask rule is still in effect. Everywhere I go, I got my mask on. I think sometimes people is really silly that come out and they ain't got no mask on. Now, I don't lie. I don't, I, I'm not lying to you. I don't wear no gloves or nothing like that, usually. But when I'm on a job, I wear my, my gloves. I wear my mask. When I'm just out in public, I wear my mask. So that's definitely one thing that we need to be doing. The other big thing we need to be doing is maintaining our social distance. Listen, this social distance thing is crazy. They talking about six feet, but it's really probably more than that. You wanna, you wanna keep people at arm's length of you and your parents and loved ones. You know, you don't need to take no crazy stuff home. You know what I mean? Make no mistake, COVID-19 has not gone away. We've seen what has happened in other states when folks let their guard down. Let's not let Delaware or our loved ones become one of those people that those type of things are happening to. Now listen, my name is Kayan Church. I'm from Reliable Aid Inc. We are your personal assistance professionals. We watch over your family just like they were ours because we love them that much. You know, we love people. You know, give me a chance to earn your business. Call me 302-689-3240, 302-689-3240. I want to thank everybody for taking time out of their day to meet with the big hearted caregiver live. You know, this is really special to me because I love our parents and seniors, you know what I mean? Don't forget to take care of everybody that took care of you, you know what I mean? If your parents brought you out the sandbox, took care of you your whole life, you know what I mean? Put you through school, you know, helped you out. Don't forget to reach back because now's your time. I love you. Take care of yourself. If you need me, call me. 302-689-3240. I'm the big hearted caregiver, Mr. KC, and I'm out. Holler at you. Peace.